folks, Joe DeRosa here. Guess who's back on the road? Officially, the run has almost begun. I don't have a name for this run yet of shows. Quite frankly, I don't like when people name their... T that doesn't matter. Listen, <laughs> here's where I'm headed. July 9th, Fairfield, Connecticut. July 14th through 16th, San Francisco, California. July... Or, sorry, August 12th through 13th, Atlantic City, New Jersey. September 1st through 3rd, San Diego, California. September 12th, Somerville, Massachusetts. And then dates to follow in Wilmington, Holland, Michigan, Grand Rapids, Michigan. Man, I'm back out Woo! there. Go to Joey... Go to Joe De Fudge. JoeDeRosaInfo.com. Go to JoeDeRosaInfo.com, and you can get your tickets there for most of the gigs, and the ones that aren't there yet will be there very soon. That's JoeDeRosaInfo.com for tickets. Also, while you are in New York City, you see it here. We're in the RV at Joey Rose's. Come to Joey Rose's in NYC, the sandwich shop. And bar for all your sandwich and alcohol needs. 174 Rivington Street. We're open Tuesday through Sunday. JoeyRosesNYC.com for details. Thank you. Taste buds. They come into the mic. Talking about the food they hate. Talking about the food they like. Two fools gonna fight, but only one food can be right. Taste buds. Man, yeah, they come into the mic. I'm talking yeah. taste yeah, buds. Yeah, there like, what is, what's no, going like, what on? Like, what is going on? So we're going to do this as a three-way battle. Each person has their, is their own man. Uh, we are three islands battling today. Nate, ice cream, versus Sal, cookies, versus me, cake. Ooh. Three-way battle of three amazing, versatile dessert foods here. Uh, I mean, these are, these are three titans, so this is a big one. This is it. I mean, if we had a fourth guy on pie, this would be game over Question, right now. Question, this was cake, cookies versus, is, was it cake or cookies versus ice cream? Cookies ice cream was the original battle. And I did, I, did ice cream win? And you took cookies, mm -hmm. which is why you got cookies again today. I took ice cream in that battle and did win. Was it close? I don't think so. Oh, well, then I what don't am think I doing here today? No, no, no. I don't think it was a slaughter, but I don't, but it wasn't like neck. It wasn't like, oh my God, this is unfair. Look how close it is. Now we also, I believe, at one point did, did cake, cake versus pie. Did we not? I could, I could pull up the, I could pull it up. Um, I think pie is not even in the ballpark. I mean, I, I would, I, know what you mean. I, I would agree. I, I, I love pie, in, but you know, I, I don't even. I like pecan we, pie. We did apple versus. It. That was my big. I did a terrible. I, oh, that's right. We did apple pie, pie versus peach pie. And pe people are like, what's a peach pie? I meant peach cobbler. No. I really should have done blueberry or ch a cherry pie. Is what I really should. I have. don't even. Nate, as the guest of honor today. Why don't you kick us off with your opening defense argument of why ice cream is so important to you, why you think it's the king of these f three foods. It's beating these out in the dessert department. It's, I think it, there's, everybody loves it. And you, like, even the, like, I'm a, I, I'm kind of a normal person with ice cream. I don't go too crazy. Uh, I think Ben and Jerry, Ben and Jerry's is kind of out of their mind right now. And like, <laughs> they're getting, it's getting too wild. And you look at like <laughs> just a chocolate good. of vanilla, and like they're it's you know they got them together. Chocolate, I was such a giant fan of chocolate. Chocolate uh, ice cream, is chocolate your ice cream was is is my go. -to. Straight up, I'll do it straight up. I'll also put chocolate. it in a cup and I'll pour milk in it and eat it with a spoon. Is that some southern thing? I think it might be a southern thing, but I don't know. But I'll I eat my, it. I'll let it melt, but you add milk. I'll add milk, and then what I kind eat of whole it. milk. Yeah. Yeah. So it makes How it like much? a milkshake. It makes it like a milkshake, but not like a chunky milk. Like it's you know. And you drink it liquidy, or you? No, no, I eat it with a spoon. But but what's the consistency? And you got a little drink at the bottom. So so do you mix the ice cream into the milk, or the milk yeah. just sits there? Right. And you're eating the ice the, cream as yeah. you normally would, and yeah. you're just kind of dipping in the milk a little bit, and then the milk eventually becomes the, the surprise at the Sounds end. Sounds good or no? So, uh, half and once half you might be nice. once you say once you say that it's like a milkshake, then sure, I get it. But uh, I do think it's a little odd to pour milk on top of ice cream. I think they uh, go together it. very well. I respect it. But uh, I think uh, here's I, I got news for you. This is going to blow your socks off a little bit. We argued chocolate versus vanilla ice cream. Vanilla won considerably. Well, that's crazy. It's not that's crazy. crazy. I, I, think, that's it's crazy. I think it's nuts. I think it's nuts. Is it, is it count putting stuff on it? Or it's like straight up. No, we straight. were saying just the best well, base flavor. Then the other shouldn't even be allowed to do this podcast. No, I was oh, team chocolate. No. I know you should be allowed. To. It should be just you, Joe. <laughs> and this is maybe this is why John's such a big fan of you. Is because this is insane. Chocolate excels in chocolate bar form. Chocolate people love it's, when people say I'm addicted to chocolate. A lot of I think first and foremost they mean 
actual chocolate. You you get you start dabbling in ice cream. The vanilla, the Madagascar vanilla bean, the the purest vanilla. There's nobody homemade it's vanilla madness. ice cream. Is good. But, I, mean, I could see it coming out of a like the that's my favorite ice cream. What's the soft serve? Yeah, soft serve oh, is that's like your favorite ice cream? is. Uh, I mean, if you if you if you're lucky to stumble upon that, it's an honor. And Us. like you go <laughs> and and you just have to go do it. The truck might pass today. The weather's here. It, do they do the soft serve? Oh, hell yeah. oh they don't do it out of the bar. Well, it depends. I'll I'm say not this a, right now. I'll it's, say it's this Mr. right Softies now. Softies coming through. All three of these foods. Chocolate rains. Chocolate cake is the best yeah. cake. Chocolate ice cream, as we both agree, is the yeah. best ice cream. And a cookie ain't shit without a chocolate chip. Vanilla doesn't really go with cookie, but uh, vanilla cake sounds odd. But I love when you when you bake like a Betty Crocker or a Duncan Hines. I like vanilla on vanilla is my favorite. You're talking about a yellow cake, I think. A yellow cake, but and with a vanilla yellow icing. yellow is... Or a buttercream yeah. icing. Yeah, that's two different. I, I that's like, two. I'll you want yellow because if they called it vanilla, icing, it wouldn't about. move. So your vanilla can't even stand on its own name. That they have to go. What's well, yellow cake? And you're like, oh, I guess I'll get it. But if they said vanilla cake, you'd walk out of the place and go, Why would I you even do something about like this? They can't dye it white. I think. Even vanilla, like true vanilla cake flavor. Because they got to call it birthday cake. Flavor. Yellow is vanilla. Let's be honest. In no, cake, how cake di- form. no, 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 cake form, no, 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 no. You don't get no, 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 no. You don't get to say that. If you say you do not get to if you say tell, that. If you tell it is if nothing. You tell to, your aunt, bake me a, a vanilla cake with vanilla. Icing. You're going to get a vanilla flavored cake. That you're yellow get cake, yellow you're cake. getting butter flavor, babe. That's why it's yellow. That thing is riding on butter. All right, this is here nor there, okay? Okay, because you're wrong. He's taking ice cream. Okay. He's taking ice cream. For me, ice cream, I got to be in the mood for it. Uh, It's cold all the time, right? Where for me, I like a treat that's either room. I like a treat that can be cold, hot, or room temperature. A cookie could do all those things. I put cookies in the freezer. I have cookies out on a plate, and and a fresh baked warm cookie is the best you've ever. Got. The only form it's, you're getting yeah. ice cream in. Is you got about eight minutes with a cookie, and then it just becomes like might as well pick it up off the I'm street. Sorry, just <laughs> that's what that's what cookies become. <laughs> You got what's their made you're unless you walk in on a and it's you have to put a clock on a cookie and for you're it to not be putting unbelievable. That clock, you're not going to look at yourself as man in the mirror, Michael Jackson. Whatever you put a clock on ice. No cream. one's leaving ice cream out for all day. Like ice you don't cream, just leave you it got out. Eight minutes or that's it. Dude. I know, but it's in the freezer. You go to the freezer and grab ice cream. It's supposed to. That's where it lives. It lives in an igloo. Wait, wait, when, you're uh, you, your you cookie. Tell me, you tell me your I, cookies carried around everywhere. I got a cookie. Oh in front of me. boys, we got a hot one today. If I put a cookie in front of me and I set an eight minute alarm and eight minutes it beeps, my cookie's no good. You might as well throw it in. Gonna break a window. Nah, it's nah, it's nah, your nah. you bring cookies, you make them at home, and you take them to a party. Well, the journey they have to go on is a nightmare. And so when it gets there, everybody's like, "Oh, these cookies are good." And then your teeth are breaking. And it's breaking to shit. It's cookies. crumbling. It's all crumbling over everywhere. It's a crumbling. mess. You mean, the, you mean a crunchy cookie? And then you got your shag carpet, and everybody's like, "Are you kidding me, dude? I just bought this." <laughs> And you got a micro. By the way, I want to point out too, Nate. I want to point out too something that Sal loves to do on this podcast. He loves to do this. He loves to to say that he likes to eat a food in a way that nobody eats the food. Where he goes, "I'll put a cookie in the freezer." No, you won't. No one does that. that. Why would you do that? Cookie in a freezer. I'll tell you what I did. I made homemade (laughs) chip witches, ice cream involved. But I put the cookies and I wrapped them and I put them in the freezer. I do do because ice cream is on the cookie. What? Yes, I made a chip witch. But if you listen to me, here's something the cookie has that neither of you have. I put cookies. thin mints in a in a uh, free that's refrigerator. Not good that's in a, the that's a that's a Girl Scout. Sure, a th- no, thin mint is a cookie, buddy. I know. I, that's I agree. not a cookie. A thin mint. I think it's a, a thin cookie. Mint, th- it literally is a Girl Scout cookie. A thin mint. I think the Girl Scouts go fast the and goddamn loose. Goddamn Girl Scouts! <laughs> yeah. I think. How about that? I yeah. think the Girl Scouts run fast and loose with that term cookie, quite frankly. The Girl Scouts are doing things for this world that you will never achieve. Oh, and do not talk down about those what girls. They, they, will, and you, you don't have the what? Girl Scout ice creams and you don't have the Girl Scout cakes. It stood the test of time. They are an amazing Allow institution in our future and they chose cookie Allow me to a raise moment. their funds. Because they can't push an uh, ice cream cart. You mean to tell you what? If they want to move some stuff, push a Dippin' Dots cart. Girl Scouts. Oh, that's, that's how about you do that? That's unreasonable. That's, that's well, that's true. the best. No, Dippin' Dots is the no. greatest thing that's ever happened Dippin in my Dots. life. D- d- they deliver. The cookies get delivered. You can't deliver a Dippin' Dot. Wait, you push hold it. On. Hold, on a, is- go to hold on a second. Go to idiot. Hold on a second. Uh, hold on a second. I- Let's stop acting like the Girl Scouts are heroes. What else are a bunch of eight-year-olds going to do with their time? They've got the time to deliver well, door-to-door the door the cookies. They could be get they could out of here. On their tablets, they could be up watching DVDs. Get out of here. They could be doing anything, but they're they're doing charitable work. I, 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 what are you talking about? Let what me else take they you now to. They're keeping charitable? America fat. 
Is that what you want? Let me take you now. It's on us. Let me take moderation. you now to the glory of cake. I was yeah. gonna. Let I was about to say something that cookies have that you guys don't have. What? Go what? ahead. You could eat a cookie fully soft bake. I mean, hot, piping hot, soft as hell. You could eat a cookie like a Tate's that is about crisp through and through. You could eat a cookie that has a crisp on the outside with a goo on the inside. The cookie is the most versatile. You can have it hot, cold, or room temperature. All these variations, all these different textures is something Who, ice cream can't do cold and cookie. something cake can't do. Nobody cake wants is a... soft and mushy. Ice cream is freezing cold. Whoa, and whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on a second. You can absolutely have cake warm. You can have cake hot. You can have it room temperature, and you can have it cold. I've taken cake straight out of the fridge and sliced it. I've taken cake out of one of those uh, glass domes. Uh, at room temperature and eating it. I've had a piece of cake straight out of the oven and eating it. You can have textures, cake. though. Your cake is just, it's a soft. No, what about, I, I had ice cream cake the other day. My, my, my most hated go. thing. Ice cream cake is my most hated thing. Well, that's crazy. That's, that's a crazy. Scam. That's not a scam. scam. That's crazy. How is it a scam? How, how that's crazy. Dare you shape ice cream into the form of a cake and then tell the kid they because it's cake. versatile. Cake. Ice cream exactly. is versatile. I can, I can, ice cream can be uh, cook. They put cookies with ice cream in the middle because that's how much cookies need help. Okay. They need help. Cake. They it's can't stand on their cake. own. It's ice cream in the form of a cake. Chocolate ice chip was, cookie is the only thing they I came can, up I with. I mold ice cream into a form of a dinosaur. Let me, Does that let mean me, it's a dinosaur? Let me, take you to why, let me take you to why the cake is superior to the cookie. First of all, let me just start there, okay? When you go to the bakery aisle in a supermarket and you see everything that that supermarket makes, it is cake city in that aisle, okay? There's a few cookies as an afterthought. Oh, oh, There's a few stop. cookies as an afterthought. It's equal shelf space. When you go to the dessert a bakery, aisle, a bakery, a bakery has equal parts cookie and cake. You're not even in it. You're, but it's cookie you're, and you're, cake. You're bat. You're wrong. Are you crazy? You're, 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 That's because I got my own shop. Because we don't even have other stuff. Ice cream shops are just like this is what we do, dude. Because we are. This is our thing, and we don't need help. I don't need a need a cake to be like, come on, I need you to move some tickets, and I need a cookie over here to help out. We're just ice cream. This is what we do. And maybe you walk by a bakery, and now, then you go, hey, I, I'll, guess what? I'll throw a cookie in my ice cream this, so I can eat it. But I will say this about the ice cream shop. There's a reason the ice cream shop is like that. It's because they can't fathom that the pig trash walking into that place <laughs> would ever be sophisticated enough to buy something like a cake. Yeah. They said they these people can't wrap their heads around anything they can't immediately ingest with a spoon as they walk. All right? I mean, you, your, your, your pick for today is, is leading to the deaths of people in this country. <laughs> you is. got people walking through you. the streets down in 1,500 calories and easy when you normally on a daily eat ice basis. Cream. When you normally eat ice cream on a hot day, and as soon as you have ice cream from the from the goddamn truck of the store on a hot day, you are on the clock. You have the balls to talk about eight minutes for a cookie. I'll eat it in the winter time. The Dead or winter, I'll the, eat ice the cream. The worst thing is standing in the street with a cone, and you're, it's literally like going to drip all over you. That's the worst part. That's of it. You're barely in those situations. You're barely, barely in them. I barely. Mean, prime ice cream time, that's a situation all the time. Well, it's, when they invented the freezer, it helped out to eat at home a lot. So no <laughs> one, this isn't 1924 where you can only eat ice cream out on the street. But you want ice cream this right is, now on they're a hot doing, day, right? You're going to a bodega. You can buy a cone. The, 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 the truck passes by, you get a cone. And, I'll and give you, you another one, you Nate. You better be good at I'll give you another one. Now, now, you get to it quick, you eat those, it. It's listen, good. They had for to those make of an us, invention for that the, catches the ice cream melting because it's been such a problem. And for you can eat that us, too. I'll give you another one. For those of us that live in society, Sal and me, New York, this isn't an issue. But for guys like you that live. I don't even know where you live, Nate. What is yeah. it, Tallahassee? Yeah. Something Tall like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're ne you live near some swamp. Yeah, yeah. It's a good yeah. 90 minutes to that grocery <laughs> store. You're not getting that ice cream home clean. It, and look, you know you're not. You're I'm, going through a refreezing process, which is bad bacterially. Yeah. No, yeah. you're not. You get the ice cream real quick. We uh, not, Everywhere not. outside of here is a normal place that has grocery stores. And you so you can, like, go to – you guys have to walk and take a subway. So you got eight blocks. It's going to take you 40 hours to get there. I got a cart. Everything's oh, gone. I bring a cart. I'm two blocks from the grocery store. You walk out of any lady. door here and you get an ice cream in under 10 seconds. I, I get that. But I'm saying if you want to take it home. If you want to take it home and you want to do it, it's going to melt. Take it home. Last year in the news, it was huge all over. People were opening ice creams and licking them during COVID. COVID and put it in the back end. You remember that? What? They they had to they had to put like a, I think people they, got jail time. A felony. It became a felony because they caught people on camera opening like the briars or whatever it was, the turkey hill, licking it and closing it back up. So who? So you blame an ice cream for that? That's not ice cream's fault. Ice cream just they sitting there. Doing it with cookies. That's another problem I have. That's another problem I have with ice cream. A lot of the brands. 
You go into the freezer at the supermarket and get your pint of ice cream. Half of these brands, you peel that top off, no plastic, yeah. nothing. Yeah, that's wild. You can get right into that ice cream. It's crazy. You can see it. You can see it. You can see it. You open it up, you know if it's been tampered with. You know, know if it's been tampered with. You really gonna I feel I feel that? great about it. It's in the cold. COVID can't live on it. That's that's, that's a sign. <laughs> I, that's I read that in a magazine on the way here, and that's it's you know your cookie. I mean, my God, COVID. No, COVID, pro, thrives, COVID started in cookies. COVID thrives in the cold. It's the heat it can't live in. Correct. No, that's true. Yeah, yes. Well, that's I don't well, think what, what, I don't believe in COVID. So what, whatever. I was gonna say. Yeah. I was gonna yeah. say you, came from a, you live in a place where they ban the vaccine. That's it. We're like. The comedy cell table on vaccines. <laughs> what? You got the vaccine? <laughs> Are you kidding me? You got COVID flavored. Yeah. Ice cream. You got Ben and Jerry's. No, listen to me. Another thing I don't like about ice cream, speaking of getting it at home and buying it in that jug, you ever go and you're like, you know what? I want some ice cream. You have it in the fridge. You take out the half gallon pint thing that. And you to open the briars, and then all of a sudden, you can't get a jackhammer into that ice cream. Forget about taking like a tablespoon and trying to dig in. You hurt your palm. You have to wait 15 a minutes tablespoon. to eat your ice cream. But who's even, Teaspoon. there's ice cream Spoon. scoopers. That This even is what the they scoop, do. Even the scooper, the scoop, You go, no, go to Baskin like, Robbins, they're doing it all day. These like, kids have forearms that are, I mean, <laughs> yeah. they look like... Uh, Tr- train workers, they like get injured, like the guy laying I tracks. Like, I don't like that. You ever see that? And it's right. You ever have company? And you're like, anybody want ice cream? And they take it out, and you go to the, and you're like, oh shit. I right, will well, well, have ice cream in ten I minutes. I will say. Yeah. I will say. So uh, of- like, as we wait to make cookies, what are you gonna do? You pick chips ahoy out? You go bring a bag out? You know how embarrassing that is. You got a party over? You're like, I made some cookies. They're in this bag of chips. They've been sitting on a grocery store for forty years. Well, who's gonna who's gonna say I made these a- cookies? Then take out chips ahoy. The people, the, the cookie people, because the cookie people point. are, you know, they just act like they all people. Want homemade cookies or they don't want cookies? That, 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 that's that's that, that's that the, statement. You sound like someone. Who, Oreos, who, I would give you. Maybe Oreos are the only ones, and that's inappropriate at a party. He's what? it's inappropriate Oreos, at a party. I'll say this right now: fuck Oreos and fuck you. No, well, you're fuck crazy. Fuck Oreos. That's crazy. Oreos He's still stink. salty from the f- match one. Oreos. Match no, one. You, Oreos you dominated did, Chips Ahoy. Yeah, well, yeah, they. It's no, much better. If you dip better. them in milk, it's a, it's a whole, it's a Ch- really good experience. Don't so, you right. dare <laughs> bring that argument in here right now. There you go. If yeah. you got to dip like it in milk, yeah, it means good. the food's not good enough on its own. No, no, it makes it nice and soft. I could eat it on its own. I'm fine with eating on its own. You give me a the box of Oreos, I'll eat them on their own. I don't You're mind. You're saying it. they're better Chips Ahoy. Yeah, dude. I don't think everybody knows that. Yeah, I'm not. It's not even. It wouldn't even. That's insane. We're together on the chocolate. Well, how can we differ on this? Uh, I just not finish. I look. I'm like cake. I will say this. I want to start shitting on cookies again. Okay. Uh, uh, When when your food predominantly comes in a bag, it's trash food. Your food predominantly is served in a bag. And that I is think, so fu- that is so stupid. Why is it stupid? You can't serve cake in a bag, and now all of a sudden cake is distinguished and cookies are Cake aren't. comes in a wonderful. Did you ever yeah. see the presentation Made. on a cake? A wonderful cardboard. You know it's been. You know it's box. been. You open people up took the care lid. Of it. It's got the cellophane. Yeah. You can see inside. Yeah. You open. Yeah. It. Cookies what? come in a bag. Happy birthday, Janet. It's nice. <laughs> can I say something? Can I say something? Here's something I'll say about cakes, and it's going to be a truth bomb. I like a homemade cake. Like you mix it and you put on your own icing and you make it at home. Outside of that, cakes are a scam. You ever go to a bakery? They look amazing. They look, oh my God, look at those, the glaze on that thing, the strawberries. Look how cool it looks. Look at the decorations. Look at the cream. You cut those bakery cakes up when you get home, they're okay. Yeah, if you it, buy the one there, but they they make it. So it's like it's like it's showing loaded, you, here's what we can do. But it's loaded with sugar. It's usually bland. And I'm talking about what, a cookie's cake. healthy? I'm going to give no, no, you. No, no, but I'm saying cake, I'm gonna, cake outside of a homemade cake at home. For me, they are underwhelming. I'm going to hit you with a string of banger cakes right now. String. Ready? Yeah. Chocolate cake with chocolate on chocolate. Yellow cake with buttercream icing or chocolate icing. Hold on. Red velvet cake with cream cheese icing. Carrot cake with cream cheese icing. Lemon cake. Traditional. Grocery store sheet cake with the sheet cake icing. Traditional birthday cake with the rainbow speckled icing. Dude, it goes on and on. Cookies, what do you have? I think that's about... You got a chocolate cookie. You got an oatmeal cookie. You got a chocolate chip cookie. Macadamia nuts. And when you think you're you're tricking a a listener by saying that? What do you mean? Like you think that people will believe there's three cookies because you only named three? Folks, Magic Spoon, baby. It's been a minute. Where you been, Magic Spoon? We're back, baby. Who loves cereal? I love cereal. 
Who loves eating kid cereal? None of this grown-up crap. Jeez, God, this grown-up crap cereal is the worst. I like eating fun cereal. I like fruity cereals and chocolate-type cereals, cinnamon-flavored cereals, all stuff like that. And that's where Magic Spoon comes in because they're letting me eat the cereals uh, that, that remind me of the cereals that I, that I had as a kid, but I can eat them now as an adult, and they don't have any of the bad stuff in them. Isn't that great? You know, when you're a kid, you can eat a box of Cal Chocula and burn it off in an hour running around through sprinklers. You can't do that as an adult. Trust me, if you run through sprinklers as an adult, it looks weird. So, Magic Spoon, bring it into your life. Bring it into your diet. I love what these guys are doing. Uh, uh, here's the thing. Uh, I, if you're trying to cut down on carbs and sugar and unhealthy food, it's, look, you, you, sometimes you feel like you can't eat anything fun anymore. But, nope, Magic Spoon. You can have Magic Spoon, zero grams of sugar, 13 to 14 grams of protein, and only four net grams of carbs in every serving. That's amazing. Only 140 calories per serving. Keto-friendly, gluten-free, grain-free, soy-free, low-carb, and GMO-free. And you can build your own box. Available flavors. Uh, uh, you know, you can. You, they've got a ton of available flavors. You select the ones you like, and you build your own custom bundle. Uh, I mean, you know, you put a, you get a cocoa box and a fruity box and a peanut butter box or a, a blueberry box, whatever it is. Magic Spoon is here to do the thing you want them to do. Go to magicspoon.com slash taste buds and grab a custom bundle of cereal. Try it today. Try it. What are you waiting for? Get off your ass. Try it. And be sure to use promo code taste buds to check out and save five dollars off your order. That's magicspoon.com slash taste buds and use promo code taste buds to get five bucks off your first order. Folks, I want to talk to you about nicotine, more specifically the product named Lucy. Lucy in the sky giving you a ray of hope. Why? You got a nicotine addiction? Why not take that nicotine into your body in a much better, healthier way, okay? Uh, suck and smoke down for your nicotine fix is not the best way to do it, folks. It's 2022. There's a better way, all right? Now, I got to read this disclaimer. Warning, this product contains nicotine. That's why I'm talking about nicotine. Nicotine is an addictive chemical. But here's the thing. If you enjoy using it, you should definitely check out Lucy's products at lucy.co. That's lucy.co. And when you go to lucy.co, I want you to use promo code TASTEBUDS at checkout. Okay? This is, again, a way to get you to get your nicotine fix in a better way. Maybe that leads you in the right direction with your other nicotine products and the amount that you're using them. I believe that this is a good thing to implement in if you're a nicotine user. So, again, I want you to go. And by the way, I've used Lucy. This is hand to God. Sorry, the wrong hand up. Hand to God, I've used Lucy. I think it's a great product, and I think it does exactly what I'm saying it will do. So, again, go to lucy.co. That's lucy.co, and use promo code TASTEBUDS at checkout. Uh, hey, everybody. Thanks for watching Taste Buds. Uh, do us a favor and subscribe on our, the No Press channel. Follow us on Spotify. Leave a comment on iTunes. That's a huge way that you could help us that costs you no money if you want to help the podcast and you love it. Merch is available for Taste Buds on our website. You can go to com for mine. JoJoRosaInfo.comedy for Joe's. Uh, tour dates. This weekend, I'll be in Rochester and Syracuse, June 10th and June 11th. Come on down. That's coming up right now. Uh, the following weekend, South Bend, Indiana, June 16th. Milwaukee, June 17th. Minneapolis, June 18th. Weekend after that, you got Hampton Beach Casino Ballroom, June 24th. And Foxwoods in Connecticut, June 25th. That's two shows that night. And just looking ahead, we got Vegas on July 15th. First time headlining Vegas at the Virgin Hotel Theater. And then we got Phoenix, Boulder, Portland, Seattle, and Vancouver rounding out July. SalVolcanoComedy.com. Uh, love to see you on the road. And I love you. I love your family. I love your parents. Even if they, maybe you're not close with your parents, but I love them. Because uh, all we need is love right now. Uh, Rolling Stones. I'll tell you what, here's what you do. This is, I'm going to do my best. We can each name 100. I'm going yeah. to do my yeah. best. I'm going to do my best. Chocolate chip cookie. <laughs> chocolate cookie. Oatmeal cookie, peanut butter cookie, 
butter cookie. Five. I'm yeah. out. I'll tell I you what, got, you're, I got you're, no other cookies. You're eating cookies because you can't afford ice cream. And that's that's the, that's the real deal. You think, you're, you think you're, that's a good thing? I think cookies it means uh, every like man, it's affordable. ice cream is ice every cream day. Ice cream out. is ice cream is every day. Ice cream shows up and it's always there and it's a meal you can eat it every night. You're just cakes are very, very it. cakes are occasions. It's it's new money and cakes are occasions. <laughs> And then uh, cookies, they've been around too long. They, yeah. they don't even, they're not even putting any heart That's into it. That's also a great no. point he's got. Ice cream and cake is an occasion. It's your birthday. We're going to have cake and ice cream. Cookies are what you give a toddler to keep the toddler busy. You're wrong. Cookies are it's, every day, in and out. They're with you. No. They're reliable. No. no but you're not eating them. From old to young. No. I know, but it's not, But you're not eating them like that. To me, I, I, could eat, I eat ice cream every day. I, and I, I've got a uh, Halo Top. I've been eating that because I'm trying to lose weight. It's like 300 I hate calories. Halo Top. No offense. Halo Top is unbelievable, and you're crazy. It, it's, and it's, it's like. They shouldn't call it's, themselves ice cream. They're like well, it ice is. flavored it's, it's no, okay. no, you, no, no. The key is you gotta that one. You do have to let sit for 15 minutes to kind of, and it gets creamier. That sounds great. I need that's what, well, dude. I, I don't know. We're trying to invent healthy ice cream. I mean, maybe give us a break for a second. All right. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's not just jammed down your throat and smeared you on it. it and wait 15 minutes. We've been doing July. big things over at Halo Top. Halo Top. My is, father made it. I I saw Halo <laughs> Top. I got excited. I said, "Wow, this is going to revolutionize ice cream." And again, this is nothing against Halo Top. It's just the type of ice cream. I bought it. I I, I threw it into a bowl. I started eating. I go, "This doesn't taste like." That's because you ate it too quick. Like you ice ate it too quick. You can throw it in the microwave for fifteen had, seconds if too. If you had a cookie, throw ice cream in the microwave. Help for a second, dude. We're trying to <laughs> save your life with this awesome ice cream. This is like the Seinfeld episode with Newman. There's no fat. This is this is it. This is what they wanted to do in that Seinfeld episode. They couldn't. They didn't have the tools to do something like this. Like but now they water. do. It does it because you eat it too quick. And they're like, my God, just give us a second, dude. We're trying to save your you're life so you don't, we don't have to you're will you out. or We don't have to carry you down steps in an emergency room because you live in a walk-up. And you got the, the poor paramedics got to come down and go, my God, how much is this ice cream you're, cookie you're, face I, weigh? I, I, you're, I trying to, you're trying listen. to sell me the bill of goods that... In order for Halo Top to taste like actual ice cream, you got to sit there and wait? You just give it what a second. Happens? Set it what out. happens while you're waiting? My God, set it out and just go do something for a second. Set Maybe. There are better, Can you do that? Set better, it out before dinner. You're going to eat dinner, set it out, eat your dinner. There are better low-calorie uh, ice creams Not, than Halo Top. I, I've only had a Halo Top, and I don't see how. I've, I started at Halo Top. I've, I've explored Halo greatly. Top, set it and forget There's it. some better ones. What? There's a there's a there's an almond cream one that'll blow your socks off, mm. uh, and I'm and I'm telling you, Nate, I can't tell it's not real ice cream. It's crazy. I can't tell Halo Top if you. I don't think you guys are giving the Halo the proper. No, I, I, way gave, it I had a nice dance for Halo Top to take to bring religion into it. The I balls. had a nice dance for Halo to Top to put a Halo over but, a pint of but cream. But I want to get back. It's that, that good. For our it's savior. something you have never seen before. It's a miracle. I want to get back to cookies for a second. Every major holiday with my family. People bring different desserts. Everybody brings a dessert in addition to whatever their dish is. You know what goes? The cakes. The 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 ice cream. You know what even goes? The fruit. Somebody always yes. brings fresh fruit. It pisses me off, but god damn it, people eat it. You know what's always left at the end? A thing of cookies, cookies. Yo, that, that somebody so bought cookies. that nobody wants to take home. Yeah. My mom begging people. To take the cookies home, nobody wants in them. In my house, if they end up in a Ziploc over, people, bag that we throw away to eventually. Take the cookies home, and I'll tell you another thing right now. And I think that you people of shit, line up. And I'll tell you why. Line if I up. I was throwing a party, right? And I on my table in, in the dining room, I put a, tr a tray of cookies, a beautiful tray of bakery cookies, uh, a pint, a pints of ice cream right there, and I put a cake. The cookies are going to go faster than those other two. No, items. that's now, crazy. Now you're lying. They're bitable, there's a yeah, variety. Yeah, that's, that's, that's not true. You can have a few. You that's not true. Please, a bowl. please yeah. stand up so I can hear you talking out of your ass clearly. That's, you're you're, you're, insane. you're I mean, everybody insane. Everybody would agree with me. You're insane. You're right, saying people right, eat cookies right. at a holiday dessert. It's nuts. You're, you're insane. You're <laughs> right, Joe, Joe, Joe. You walk into a party. I almost just passed out. I got so mad. I almost just passed out. You walk into a party. This is nuts. You walk into a party. There's ice cream. A party you walk into. Yes. There's but it's pints of Briar's ice cream, a yep. half gallon. Uh -huh. There's a, a, a pyramid of assorted uh -huh. cookies. Yep. And then there's one cake. Are you taking a knife, slicing a piece of yep. cake and eating yeah. the cake? Are cake you first. And, getting, and you scooping out ice cream? Or are you going to walk over and be like, and pop a cookie into your mouth? Nope. Which no. one no. are you cake. doing? Be honest with I'm us. I'm going to say, oh, be cake, honest oh with us. cake first.
first every single you're time. You're gonna slice your own piece of cake, put it on the plate, and start eating a piece of cake. Not only before you pop a cookie not only into am, your mouth. Not only am I gonna slice the cake, I'm gonna slice the cake for everybody. I'm gonna go across, across, yeah. zigzag. Yeah. Now everybody gets a piece. That's how I do it. All right. and I'm gonna do it. You're gonna walk into someone's house and start slicing the cake. Up? I'm gonna say, "Where's your cake yeah. knife? Give me your cake knife." You're not gonna say that. Nobody believes. And they're gonna go. And they're they're gonna go. Guess what? You don't need a cake knife. You can use any knife because it's not a brick like these cookies are. Oh, and they're, you, gotta, nice. you gotta have like scissors. Dude, you you gotta a, call a guy over. You ever walk, in, walk into a party? With hey, sir, you're cutting the grass. Do you mind coming in and cutting these cookies up so people can eat them? <laughs> you tell me right now, wherever you, if you've ever been to a party with anyone over 12 that you've seen them walk around with a bowl of ice cream <laughs> eating ice cream. You imagine walking into a party with 30, 20, 30, and 40 year olds and people are walking around eating ice cream out of bowls? That doesn't happen. Because you cookie it's people are the government and you make people feel bad. And people <laughs> Want they want that cake? They want, I would I walk in. I would get a slice of cake. I'd get ice cream on it, and I'd throw your cookies in the People toilet. And everybody, cookies. I'd get a standing. Everybody would stand up and go, "Thank God, someone did it. Someone did it." Because you made know. these. Guess what? You made these cookies last night because you're too lazy to get up a little bit early and make them in the day, so at least could have day fresh cookies. Last night you made them about seven o'clock. I don't get them till four the next day, and they're awful. There, there is no, so what are you doing? There you is no sweet. Yours there is no. Like, I froze this so we can have it later. I left it in the freezer all night. When you get it, then put it back in the freezer. Sal, Do you mind doing no, a little? Sal, there is no sweet snack. Okay, like 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 in this wheelhouse that we're talking. I'm not going to count candy because candy is is truly just to me a snack. There's no sweet treat, whatever you want to call it, dessert food. That is less underwhelming to me than cookies. Oh when I go home after a long night and I'm sad and I want a little treat to, to help me drift off to sleep and I say I'm going to be bad, I'm going to eat something I shouldn't eat, it's ice cream or yeah. cake. It is never cookies, That's now. you? It's that is never not cookies. Earth. That's you, babe. That's you. People come to someone's house, I baked you cookies. They don't say, I Who the I hell you. says this? Yeah. Oh, who, I mean, this ding dong. Oh, thank you for coming. Thank you so much. We churned you some ice cream. Who the hell is No, they bring that? ice cream. They can who? buy it at the store because it's that good. Uh, you can't get you can't. But what are you going to do, dude? That wasn't like. Ice cream. You have to be how skilled. much time do your you friends have homemade that homemade everybody's just baking cookies, cookies all day? Sell have kids for five year olds. Have you ever baked cookies in your life? Have you ever baked cookies in your life? Have you ever churned your own ice cream? Hold on a second. No! They have, they have little I've toy seen it. kits. You've I've had seen, seen it. I've had a homemade ice cream. Oh, Best on. ice cream I ever had a long time ago. I think about it every day. I wish I could have it today. Right, right, because people, yeah, people throw home. Look, people I'll give you the ice cream. It. They throw homemade ice cream on a lot of labels. It's not. It's not homemade by the way, ice cream. By the way. Can we let's cut the shit here with the baking cookies routine like you're some kind of martyr. You buy a tube that looks like a no, dildo in the store you and you slice that's them off and you put do. them on a pan that's and what throw you them in the do. oven for a, a Betty Cracker cake takes more effort than that. Babe, Google from scratch. Do yourself a favor. Go Sal, scratch and Google scratch. I because have never even that's seen his you version make of baking cookies. That's his version. To buy the fucking Pillsbury dough and slice it with a knife and put it and by the way, still good. Who's doing that? Who's doing? Who's who's who's? Yeah. When, when cookie the hell, dough. When have you ever had somebody cookies say I made so you cookies good, from scratch? It doesn't even make it. If they the came oven, up to me, eat it when it's it's raw. If they gave me a choice, they go, uh, uh, I'm gonna make some cookies or I can make some brownies. I'm gonna I'm gonna have break brownies. Well, if they're brownies making something, not in this battle right now. But I'm Maybe just showing you. That's how much I don't want cookies. Is I would be like, we'll just uh, do the brownies. Brownie, I, I would take brownie over ice cream and cake. As well. Well, that's the, you're dumb. Uh, look, if I had brownies, that's, if I, brownies, if I, if cake, I had brownies, cake, if I come on. Yeah, brownies, those, brownies. If I had to only keep brownies, one of those, cake. No, it's not. It's like saying the milkshake isn't ice cream. It's come on, man. What are we talking about here? A brownie. See, it's it's ice cream, dude. Milkshake. I'm not, no, I'm not, you got a McFlurry. Not, you got a, you got a, that's a, a not, Blizzard. That's not ice cream. That's ice cream. A Blizzard's ice cream. Shake a shake is a shake. It's, but it comes from ice cream. It's just how you're doing it. If you're eating a little bit smoother. Oh, guess what, guys? We all have chocolate flour and egg in and, and Well, we do. So is it the same thing? No. It doesn't no. get out to be the no, same. But that's not dessert the, that's not is the, very limited. Sorry. How could you say the most versatile of the three desserts is limiting? I'm still waiting for you to hit me with the flavors past what I already named. You still can't do it. But you, you named the five okay. most popular so, bakery types. So ver most versatile. Keep going. Okay. There's pinolis. There's bakery cookies with raspberry in the middle dipped in chocolate. Ugh. There's 
What? How much help does a cookie there's, need? There's a it can't even stand now, on its now, own. Now, now I'm naming them. Mine are mine. Chocolate, chocolate shows up by itself and says, this is what you get. This, I'm here. Way, and way, your cookies now. show up with way, God knows Chow, what's in them because they can't hang on, on their own. Chow is swinging to the point that you're, he's now into you're naming you're cookies me, that only he's he's now. They're out of control. Ben and Jerry's is a problem. Sal is now. Sal is. It's because your cookie people came over. It's you can't just handle normal stuff. Sal is flailing to the point. He's now naming flailing. cookies that six nanas and Here's Rich Tyler Aronovitz. make at Christmas right. time. So we saw what happened here, right? He turned to me and shouted at my face to name more than the three cookies he named. I'm in the middle of naming my fourth in a row, and now it's uh, they need help. Nanas make them. Just shut up. You're not even now. You're saying like you're shut like uh, I like a cookie that has uh you, you know has talk, some money on top of it. You ever have that? Retail space. I got what a the retail space I got a cookie, cookie that has a twenty dollar bill on it. Those are good. Like they, that's how much help a cookie needs. Sugar they got to put cash on you it. Put icing on cookies too, and write happy birthday Deborah on them as well. Huh, you could make dick cookies for nobody wants parties. a cookie with what? icing on you it. You do. Nobody shapes, wants a cookie with shapes. icing. Oh. oh, cookie cutter. Okay, you can make all sorts of fun shapes of cookies. Christmas cookies, snickerdoodles. Sugar cookies. I said Alcohol. sugar cookies are just basically you're going. I, I I would love to like just chocolate. eat sugar. Pecan I would love to drink chocolate. sugar. These are chocolate shit chocolate. cookies. Chocolate with peanut butter. Nobody wants the pecan cookie. Oreos. Oreos has a thousand flavors. What? Nobody wants the pecan. Chocolate cookie. What's the Oreos flavors? All right. Well, now you get into blizzards. Butter butters. So that's blizzards. Butter but Hippers. then why can't a blizzard be ice Hippers cream if all your your Hippers. cookies can have wafers? Yeah. That's, he's nice. got a point. If wafers can be cookies, then a milkshake is ice cream and brownie is cake. Don't take wafers off the table. Don't try to get your bullshit across. Oh, please. Wafers are cookies. What would you call a brownie then if it's not cake? What would you call it? I would call it a brownie. No, what would you call why it? Why isn't it called chocolate cake? Because it's not chocolate cake. It's what is a, it? It's a form it's of a, a chocolate, chocolate, chocolate flavored cake. Yeah. Chocolate cake. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Here's what. <laughs> <laughs> cookies. Cookies are. You stupid asshole. <laughs> God, if I let you argue long enough, you'll just cross your own fucking <laughs> argument out. Cookies. Cookies can't stand on their own. Cake and ice cream can come on their own. Cookies need so much help. They have to have chocolate chips in them. They have God, to have like what the your. Is. You I know, but they let need let him, let him all kinds of stuff. Cookies need all ice cream. You get you gotta get put cream in it. No, 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 no. But ice cream, show you get a chocolate ice cream. Everybody's gonna thank you very much for doing. I love chocolate ice cream. But cookies, you they just can't ever be alone. A vanilla wafer, I'd imagine, be its own thing. That's like the a worst cookie. cookie of all time. But that's like that's the only one because that's like it's like hey, do you want? Nate has a point. Like we're trying to sell. Hey, we're trying to move cardboard over here. So here's a vanilla wafer. One of the beauties of cookies is that you can take this so versatile. You can take all different ingredients. Every you can come make a cookie out of a million things. Sal, Cookies trying that's to what get, you're trying to make it a negative. Sal, out of it? Sal, ice cream can make the cookie dough good because the cookie dough is the beginning of a cookie. And ice cream's buff, like, I look, buff, I'll buff. help you out. We don't, Let me help you out because you can't I even made the be same made. Same argument when we, we argue. We this. don't inject cookie dough. We don't inject ice cream into our cookie. Well, you dough. should make start. Mistake, we Sal, inject cookie Sal, dough into the ice cream. Sal. The cookie dough is doing the Sal. heavy lifting in that area. Yes, it is. He's got. Let me hold on. He's got. He's got a good, filled but ice he cream does. Balls. No, hold on a second though. But he makes a great point. Now, hear me out. He makes a great point. A ch you rarely <laughs> I've see. Been here all day. You. I'm a stroke in here. <laughs> you rarely. Maybe see. don't eat as many cookies. Yeah, I bet you. I bet you love some ice cream right now. I bet you would love some ice cream right now. Listen to this. This is the guy cutting down Halo <laughs> tops. Yeah. Like the guy's ice. shitting all over Halo tops. He's gonna have a stroke because it's 77 yeah, degrees yeah, yeah. outside. 77. I mean, yeah. we're sitting in a tin. Box. Listen to me right now. Nate company. makes a great point. You ra you rarely, almost never see just a cookie that's just a chocolate cookie. It's a chocolate cookie with other stuff in it. It's a vanilla cookie with other stuff in it. Not true. It, he just said you rarely see a chocolate cookie. Yeah. With I mean, not without without other stuff in it. It has to not have true, stuff bud. in it. Not true. I ate them last night at my father's house. Did it have chocolate chips it in it? It was just chocolate, famous chocolate wafers by Nabisco. They were chocolate discs. They very much tasted like what an Oreo would taste like, but they were thin, crispy chocolate discs. Ugh. I ate them last Sounds night. Sounds horrendous. You, you barely see Imagine they that. Were Imagine Oreos. Were <laughs> they were <laughs> delicious. Yeah. delicious. Terrible. <laughs> you're, you're like eating... You're so uh, funny. You just yell out five cakes, and then you just sit Why back. don't you just say, I bet, did oh, you also have some black licorice? <laughs> that's the that's the that's what you're basically doing. 
You're the house that you go to, and everybody's like, "What do you got a snack on?" I got black liquors. I got cookies that are no fun. And you're like, "Oh, this is a great you time." How disappointed I would be if I went to a dinner party and the dessert was just cookies. I would oh. be furious. Do you have milk? I and would you're be like, ah, I got almond milk. Well, and you're, like, you're setting up a scenario that is known. To have like coffee and cake. So that's your scenario. That's the wheelhouse of an after dinner. Usually it's not cookies. But when people ring the bell and they come over and they say, I baked you something, it's usually cookies. But you, you no, can, you it's can usually, paint the picture. No, it's usually you a, nobody uh, brings anybody ice cream, bro. Nobody. nobody I know because you can do it on your own. Anybody. Nobody rings the bell and says, I, I bought ice dude, cream. Because ice cream doesn't need help. Cookies have to be, no one's buying cookies. So someone has to force them down someone's throat or they would never eat them. Ice cream, ice cream is just, you go buy it on your own because it's so great that everybody wants it at their house. You can almost be positive they have it at their house. But cookies, you got to trick people into doing it. You're like, oh, hey, I made some cookies because okay. I've been sitting on them for four days okay. and no one wants these cookies. Let me ask you guys a question, okay? We ring 10 bells. We leave here right now. Go on foot. We ring 10 bells and say, do you have cookies in your house? Do you have a cake in your house, or do you have ice cream in your fridge? But they're going to have ice cream. Cake's not going to have cookies hold in my hold house. Hold on, 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 hold on. I'm going to shut that argument down right now. That's like saying, let's ring ten. That's like saying, what's better, milk or champagne? Go ring ten bells and yeah. see who's got milk versus champagne. Cake a famous and DeRosa cake and comparison. ice cream. Just because That's it's like saying milk and champagne. No, Why? I'm serious. How is that like saying because milk and champagne? Cookies are a common food. There's nothing special about them. It's like are having they potato common chips. Or are they not? It's like having potato chips in the house. It's like having pretzels in the house. Who gives a shit? Why are they It's just why a are little they snack food. You call it common. You call it common. I call it popular. Okay. All right. Well, Accessible. you're wrong. You're wrong. The choice people are making more than the choice of yours. Right, right. No, I think they're, people are eating ice cream a lot. So you, you, you agree, though. You agree that cookies will win because you said they are... Water would win in, in, in what do you That's have? It doesn't argument. mean it's better. It's it, it, you got me. More people, more people have peanuts. More people have peanuts in their house than Cheetos. It doesn't mean peanuts are better than Cheetos. It's it's commonplace. Of course, more people are going to have. No, cookies. we're talking about three. It's a simple we're talking about Philistine food. We're talking about three of the most staple powerhouse desserts. Oh, I love it. Every time he's losing, he starts saying powerhouse. I, I just called all three of our things titans in the industry. Oh, okay. I'm what sorry. Are you talking about? I didn't hear that. I thought and you just meant uh, yours. They're all titans. Nothing is com Look, common. Look, the sun went behind a cloud all... for a second. Are you still going to have a yeah. stroke? <laughs> <laughs> Did it cool you down, cookie boy? They're all by <laughs> Folks, have you ever been in credit card debt? More importantly, high interest credit card debt. Well, I have. Most of us have, and it's terrible. It can be a horrible feeling when you have a hard time climbing out of that hole. And Upstart is a company that wants to help you do that. Upstart is providing a light at the end of that tunnel. Okay? Saying goodbye to that high-interest credit card debt is your first step towards financial independence. All right? But... When you're in that debt and the interest is piling up month after month after month, you can feel like you're on a hamster wheel. That's where Upstart comes in, okay? Upstart-powered personal loans can help you pay down your high-interest loan debt all online with simple, easy-to-use-and-understand payment terms. Upstart has helped over 1.8 million customers on their path to financial freedom. Whether it's paying off credit cards, consolidating high interest debt, or funding personal expenses, Upstart can help you get one fixed monthly payment with a clear payoff date. Upstart knows that you're more than just your credit score, which a lot of companies will make you feel like, like, like all of a sudden, no. well, let's see what your score is, as if that's, you have no more, and that sucks. Because sometimes you get into a little trouble and you're actually responsible and have money coming in, but your score is still screwed. Let Upstart help, okay? Because you're worth more than that score, all right? They're, uh, they, they, they realize that. And their model considers other factors like your income and employment and your information provided when they're considering your loan application. So you're not going to be defined just by that credit score when you're applying for one of these loans. You can check your rate, your credit, or sorry, you can check your rate in minutes uh, for loans between $1,000 to, to, to $50,000. Uh, and it, none of this impacts your credit score because that's the other thing. Sometimes when you're trying to just figure out what you're eligible for, your score gets affected or negatively hit. Upstart isn't going to do that. Again, perusing the possibilities for you from loans ranging from $1,000 up to $50,000, it's not going to affect your score when you look into this. Go do this for yourself if you need some help. Don't wait. Check your credit rate today at upstart.com slash taste buds. Again, 
Upstart.com slash taste buds. That's upstart.com slash taste buds to check your rate today. And don't forget to use our URL to let them know that we sent you. That URL is upstart.com slash taste buds. Loan amounts will be determined based on your credit, income, and certain other information provided on your loan application. Go to upstart.com slash taste buds. What's up, Chicky D's? Uh, I want to talk to you about Bespoke Post. Okay. Bespoke Post. Take your summer adventures to the next level of Bespoke Post and their new seasonal lineup of must-have box of awesome collections. Bespoke Post partners with small businesses and emerging brands to bring you the most unique goods every month. Um, I've, ha- I've had three Bespoke Post boxes so far. Uh, I, I got a machete delivered to my house, uh, and it's, I, I'm going to chop down uh, the weeds in my backyard with it. I, had, I would never buy a machete otherwise, but uh, they have all these different categories that you might like so i also got uh the terra box and it came with a a knife uh that was made by bare bones in based in salt lake city so that's the cool thing about it you are uh supporting small businesses when you do it no matter what you have going on this season box of awesome as you covered from camping gear essentials beach day travels and must-haves box of awesome has everything you need for the summer uh, there's a new one in here because I'm going to do a lot of traveling this summer called the Weekender. So another thing I've never done was be able to buy uh, a bag for suits. What do they call that? Uh, garment bag. Garment bag. I'm always uh, I'm always like thinking about getting one I never had. That's what's so cool about. It. So they had this Weekender. I got a dark blue one. It features metal hardware, reinforced frames, and quality leather straps. What's up, buddy? Hey, little, buddy. little kid just roamed into the <laughs> the room from the street. All right, buddy. And he looks like he is adorable. He is. Buddy, what, where's you, your f- hey, what do you think about Bespoke Post? <laughs> where's, your fa- you- <laughs> where's your family, too? Where's your There's, family? There they are. All right. God bless that kid. Uh, so here's what that you kid, do. That yeah. kid looked <laughs> like a 53-year-old man. He did. <laughs> he, looked like, he looked like Big Pun as a child. <laughs> to get started, take the quiz at BoxAndAwesome.com so they know what you like and you don't like, and they'll... Uh, and they'll give you suggestions based on that your answers help them pick the right box for you they release new boxes every month tons of different categories like we said each box is valued at about new york city baby street sweeper new york <laughs> each box is valued at around 70 bucks you pay a, a fraction of that price and uh, again you're supporting small business 90 percent of everything that comes from there is from a small and upcoming brand get 20 percent off your first box uh, your first monthly box when you sign up at boxofawesome.com and enter the code TASTEBUDS at checkout. That's boxofawesome.com, code TASTEBUDS for 20% off your first box. Boxofawesome.com, code TASTEBUDS. They're all popular. And I how, think we you pissed agree off with me. everybody on this street, me. by the way. You agree with me. Look at this. The people at the coffee shop are going inside. <laughs> I think we're pissing everybody off. You people agree. are looking in here like, what is going on? Yeah. In you just agreed with me what that cookies happened? would win that. And you, you, you tried no, to cover it up by saying cookies are common on. food. But win because they're common. Not win because they're better. That doesn't mean they're better that more people have them. Joe, you're telling you know me ice cream is not common? Sal. Cake is not common? Sal. Sal. Joe, Joe, Sal. listen to you know what, what you're saying. You're ridiculous. You know why people, people don't have cake in the house? People choose cookies more than Do you know why people don't have cake in the house? Do you know why people don't have cake in the house? I can't have it in it's the house because I'll eat all of it. Oh, God, Joe. Come That's on, why. Joe. Ice cream is common. Cake is common. Cookies are common. Cookies aren't in more houses. I don't common. keep ice cream and cake in my house because I can't be trusted with it. Do you keep cookies in your house? I got bags oh of them. Oh my god! I got bags. So let's of break them. down exactly what he just said right now. He's arguing against cookies tooth and nail, and I just asked him, "What do you have in your house? Cake, cookies, or ice cream?" He says, "I do not have ca- Did I uh, say ice cream. I, bought them? I do not have cake. I only have cookies in Did my I house." Did I say I bought this them? man? Did just I say I bought it them? Out loud, he doesn't have cake or ice what cream. What part do you know? Only cookies. Did I say? And then you have something to say to me? Did I say I bought them? Number one. Did I say I bought the cookies? What's in your house? I don't care if you p- get They currency. were in a gift basket that my parents gave me. Why? Why wasn't the cake in the basket? Because they brought a cake for the holiday. We ate some of it, and then they took the rest home. I don't think my parents ever bought me a gift basket. They gave My parents gave me a gift basket for Easter. It had some cookies in it. I put them in the closet. I never I feel like them. it's a weird gift for parents why do to I give not a have, child. Why do a I gift not, basket? Why do I not have cake and ice cream in my house? Because I will eat it. Right. So then, when do, right. so, when, so when do you eat it then? On special occasions, because I don't I, because I'm trying to look right. out for my diet. So the cookie is is everywhere. It's I have way more ice cream than cookie. Cookie sits there way collecting dust cream. in my house. Not even not even close. Well, that is you, and you choose yeah. you, ice cream is your favorite. But if you if you take a poll, yeah, 
cookie is But if be, someone goes, you got cookies, they'd go, I don't Yeah, I, mean, I bought some. If they I made think a guy Halo that lived here before cake, me. I have it some. in my house. Shit, I definitely got a ticket. If they got a Halo well, top Well, you deserve it. If they have a Halo <laughs> If they made a Halo top cake. Can you continue while I pay my meter? You got a ticket already. Let it go. Just let it go. No, yeah, I, yeah. If I don't, I don't want to get a, a hundred fifty dollars like ticket. Up, yeah. Yeah. Let's yeah. just yeah. finish it. Yeah. All right. If yeah. you, it, we live in a society. A, we're, we're at like forty. Forty. Again. Yeah. We didn't get a split point. We'll just cut it and do it. Do yeah, it. yeah. Okay. When they make a Halo top cake, I'll put Halo. <laughs> I'll put a Halo top cake in my house. I once in a while have ice cream, and usually, and it's big. And when I do, it's some sort of version of a Halo top thing. Yeah. And I don't even keep that in the house because I'm trying not to eat the sugar. Cookies. I don't give a shit about. They're in my house because I got them as a gift and I don't care. And proof positive how much I don't care is they sit there collecting dust and I don't eat them. They have to be fresh made. I just don't want to throw them away. Cookies have to be out of the oven. Like no cookies good. No cookie has redeeming qualities at all. And you don't like cookies. That's not true. I didn't say I don't like No, I'm just saying I'm not tempted. I didn't say I don't like cake. I'm just saying cookies are the best of those three. If you eat them out of the oven, cookies are unbelievable. But that's it. After that... It's it's a piece of rock that's flown through the sky. The rock is the frozen ice cream that you have to wait fifteen. It's not frozen, dude. No, mouth. that's no, that's it. it. Depends what kind of freezer you got. All right, and so uh, you get a freezer. Most ice cream briars you put in our freezer. You get out, you just scoop it in. You're gonna eat it, dude. We have a great ice cream scoop. Maybe you go buy a good ice cream scoop. You're doing it with a teaspoon. So I mean, you're like yeah, I'd have I'd hate ice cream if I didn't have the you tools special, to get it. You need special utensils and tools to have your ice cream. You need a spatula to get the cookies out because it's gonna stick to the thing that you got it on. You can't even touch That's them. That's the other thing. You got to use dude. a shovel, and you got to bring someone in. That's <laughs> again, you got to hire outside, and you got to bring someone in, some construction crew, and get them to like just get it off the pan. That's the other thing too. That, that Nate brings up a great point. Ice cream never made wrong. Ice cream is always ice cream, basically. Cake, even when it's made poorly, you can still salvage the middle part. Oh, and shit. Get some yeah. Yeah. Stuff. The cake at home, cookies. you bang something, the cake drops. When my mom used to bake cookies, cakes, it was like, can I shut let, the fuck up for 90 let minutes? Let me finish my point. Cookies. Oh, God. You get a bad one, that's it. That's it's a uh, wrap, dude. I'm honest, it's, it's, it's not a, it's you not a, a, you a get, I mean, you, salmon, Joe. It's it's sure, it's it's it's, it's few and far between. It's few. You're like you said. You're gonna go. You go buy any cake anywhere. It's probably gonna be great. Ice cream. Don't even question it. It's gonna be good. And they're even doing gelato. Do like you know I, I think, think. But you, you know go get a cookie. You know it's. I, I mean, I'm good gonna, luck. You, good luck. You know why I think you guys are coming at me because. Cookie is the thing that has to be the, has to be argued against the most because it is the clear winner. You know, today I did I noticed something today. Something registered with me today. This was a classic DeRose app where you had terrible arguments. Today. No, I didn't. Yeah, this is you're gonna see in the comments we're like, oh god, DeRose's arguments. How terrible. were my arguments terrible? You, read the comments. I you I couldn't barely get a word in because you're screaming about, about cookies. Well, because I, I I wanted to bring the heat today. I will, you brought the heat. I want to bring it. I will tell you this right now. This is all I need to say about cake. It's moist. It's got delicious icing. It comes in a versatile uh, uh, array of flavors. It is a treat when you get it. Every it is a joy thing, at the every, end of the meal when somebody bakes it. it when somebody Everything. when somebody bakes one for you, it means so much more than a cookie. Yes. It's up there with pie in the effort department. It's it just it kills. Seeing a, seeing a what sick. else is there to say? Everything you said, and every single thing you said. Entimins. And I, you could have said you if I didn't know what you were talking about. It could also apply to cookies. Entimins. Entimins. Amazing cakes, front to back. They're you know, cookies. I could care less about their cookies. Uh, Stella Doro, take a hike. I don't care. You already know my thoughts on Oreos. Stella Doro Sh- Swiss Fudge is one of the best cookies ever made oh. in retail. I like the All idea right. that you, uh, when you get done eating, uh, you smoke a cigarette, you can put it out in your ice cream. You ever see... The people do that. That I'll looks say good. This too. As a cookie, I'll say this too. what are you going to do? It's going to relight it. Right. You put it on there. It's just, <laughs> you, people use the matches and they're I'll just going on a cookie. I'll say cake and ice cream. You can have cake and ice cream together or you can have them both solo and you're happy. Cookies, every person I know besides me when they have a cookie has to have milk with it. Yeah. And I stand by my argument that if you can't have it by itself, then your food has got a problem. I yeah. stand by you're that. Right. I like that. You're right. I like nobody, that. Nobody can eat a cookie by itself. You're right. Yeah. You told me nine. You have said these exact words to me. Preference. You can remember in under five times in your life when you haven't dunked a cookie. That's my. That's my preference. I can eat a cookie without milk, no problem. Of course you can. You're, you're I can living. eat a hot dog with you no mustard. Who the hell wants to? Milk. You know. But you're, you're living a lie, is what. 
is that you you you're going to eat these cookies alone because you're been programmed to think this is what you're supposed to do. But cookies need so Can't much. Can't wait help. for my birthday ice cookie. Cream, ice Could cream. you yeah. imagine on your birthday if your mom goes, "We're going to get you cookies." They get a year? cookie cake. How sad you but would you're be. You're choosing yeah. the occasion <laughs> that a cake. That's the cake's wheelhouse. You hey, can't just say, honey, I was thinking for our wedding. What if we just got a pile of cookies case, yeah. instead? Right, you got, you that got, divorce, you got boom. Special, you got special occasions on lock with the cake, and I have the other 360 days of the year. After the funeral, everybody come back to our place for cookies and yeah. coffee. Go f*** yourself. <laughs> I think your cookie. I, w- I would carry your... The, ice, I'm, the I'm way I would defend cake. cookies. Mur- ice cream is murdering the United States of America. It's murdering. Oh, yeah, that. cookies are doing great. So it's... Uh, I would say with your cake, out of all the things, it's what I would want in a street fight to have. Why? Because it's so hard that I think I could damage Why? someone's head with it. What, a cookie? That's, yeah, I would want it as a, a little, weapon. A cookie. I want as a weapon. I would, I would put uh, a half gallon of ice cream in a plastic shopping bag and spin it like a sock with a sack of nickels. I could clump it. You could drop ice cream. You may tell me you do. You, you, somebody. you and your you guys go become friends. Because he goes, what's that ice cream you yeah, hit me yeah, with? Yeah, yeah. And then he, and it's going to be amazing. Yeah, yeah. Oh, do you me know what favor. I want? Go, go, up to, go, up to, go up this fire escape right here. Drop an Oreo. See what happens. Yeah. Go up there. Drop a half gallon of Roy's ice cream and, and kill somebody. You know Someone's going to catch it and take it home. You yeah. know what I want in a street fight? A cake. Here's why. Guy goes, I'm going to kill you. I go. How about some cake? He'll go, yeah. I forget about it. Forget Let's about it. Have some forget cake. about and it. And you're going to have a nice afternoon with That's that man. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. All right, pimp. I this do, is it. I do want to run one thing by you. Did yeah. you see the new Ritz cracker collaborated with Oreo to make a ri- half Ritz? No. What? Absolutely disgusting. That sounds insane. Yeah. Abs- can, can I never have seen minute, it. Can I take three minutes? They, these, people, okay. these people got yeah, two. Yeah, yeah. Two seconds. All right. It's fine. I'll I'll vamp while you're yeah. gone. Joe, this is what people want on the podcast is just you. I know. I know. You're going to see the numbers spike. I know. I know. Do you? I mean, there's, there's going to be more people that are just like, God, you remember when Sal paid? <laughs> Sal drove here today from the set of his seventh TV show. Yeah, yeah. He's running to pay a $65 yeah. ticket right now. Yeah. Jesus Christ, this guy. Yeah. Unreal. I don't want to get a ticket. <laughs> <laughs> He's on a network. They just air it all day My long. God, dude. He spends that money in Tic Tacs. Yeah. It's like, what? what is he doing? What do you guys think of the, all the new fish-flavored ice cream? It's like salmon and oyster. That's no, that's disgusting. crazy. That's crazy. I had that mac- ice cream. They, they, they the go back to normal. one yet? No. So gross. Where's that at? Uh, I forget. I think Van Lewins makes it. It was really gross. I've never. Or I, might have been, I don't know. It was one of the. I've never come in a mint chip, mint chocolate chip fan. I was not a fan. And I've really. Nah. Yeah, I get in a, a groove. I'm, I'm a very normal chocolate. I, you know, chocolate's my number one. I never. I love Hershey syrup on chip. vanilla, though. You mix yeah. it up and then you pound it and then you stir it up. And it's it's but that's super because fun. It, then it turns it into chocolate. That's why. Well, I just like to do some <laughs> exercise before I get there. But what you just said is you're turning your vanilla. You go as long as I can turn it into chocolate with syrup. I well, because like vanilla is because I mean, look, it I don't stinks. You don't got to. I know. Me. But I, but if you have good vanilla, it can be really good. But that's going to be like the odds of finding a good. I cookie. said this about vanilla when we argued it. Uh, when I get when I have like when it's like a Neapolitan ice cream, I go to the vanilla just to prevent me from eating all the strawberry and chocolate ice cream because it's so Z. good. I go to the vanilla as like as like a governor to be yeah. like, just take a bite of that so you don't eat all the best yeah. part yet. You know what I mean? Like that's literally what I use vanilla. I for. leave strawberry. I will leave it in it and throw it away. Huh? That's how much I won't eat strawberry. If I got the I, I would like strawberry ice no. Cream. Why not? I, I don't know. I don't think I like a lot of strawberry stuff. I uh, will give you this: strawberry flavor versus actual strawberry taste is 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 it, there's, it's different. It's yeah. not as severe as watermelon flavor versus yeah. watermelon, which I love watermelon flavor. I hate watermelon fruit. I love banana fruit. I hate banana flavor because the yeah. flavors versus the fruit taste is so different. But strawberry is one that teeters on it, where there is like there is like a like like strawberry flavor. There's like an effervescence to it or something where it almost opens up your sinuses mm. where you're like, whoa, wow, that's yeah. strawberry right there, baby. You know, what do you guys think of Italian ices? I love uh, Italian ices. Yeah, I, I like them, too. I like that kind of stuff. But I have to have it very specifically. I have to have l- predominantly lemon with a little bit of strawberry or cherry. If it's too much cherry, it ruins it for me. But lemon's always got to be the base for me with Italian ice. The tartness of that. 
is what I'm there for. People that eat chocolate, Italian ice, I think are psychopaths. I think it's a truly like a, a, a sick thing. Yeah, that's in that's your head. weird. I don't what, understand. Uh, that's so weird. Italian ice, that's like a slushy, right? Like it's yeah. no, yeah. it's like hard ice that you scrape off with a little yeah. uh, wooden spoon. Oh, what's the difference? Here's Sal. Slushy <laughs> is a, <laughs> a slushy is slush. Like it's like literally like slushy. It's like a melted Italian ice, no? No, because it's chunky ice. It's not like a Slurpee, but you drink a slushy. But a slu- like an icy is like that too. It's actually like chunked ice with like a syrup mixed in that gives it flavor. Italian ice is hard. Like you have to make you have to let Italian ice melt a little bit before you can eat it. But even then, it 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 scoops off almost like the way ice cream does. Yeah. Now, and then it hey, where's his out. car? It was not right there. He said right. his car was like right there. And it's not right there. Know. He probably got a ticket. He's probably having a panic attack because he got a ticket. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, here, I see him walking down. Yeah. But a lot of the fans are writing that uh, cake and cookies are useless without ice cream. That well, they're both accessories to ice cream. I'll accept yeah. that argument with I cake, get that. but not with cookies. Yeah, but cookies need. I think cookies need ice cream help. Well, a lot. I just think it's weird to say cookies and ice cream just go together all the time. I don't. Think they don't go true. together, but they're always going to be good. And like ice cream, like uh, you, if someone goes there, cookies and ice cream, you're going to be like, yeah, absolutely, I'll take it all. Did I win yet? No, that's fine. I trashed you the whole time you were going I about how t- panicked you were about a sixty-five dollar ticket. Did wasteful. you get a ticket? Huh? No, I didn't. Thank God. I know, but I still it's trash wasteful. you. I know, but it's fun to trash you about. You it. had the nerve. I'm just being transparent. Really, trash me about worrying about getting a ticket. You run your life by your parking garage. His parking garage. He he joins a parking garage that closes at midnight. Do you understand? Ten times a month, he looks at his watch. He goes, "It's Do ten o'clock. Understand? I gotta go. My parking garage closes at midnight." I go, how? "You're letting this ru- rule your life." Do you understand? He, he runs home like Cinderella. Hold on a second. Do you understand how famous you are? That's why I make fun, not because of the what are you anxiety. Talking about the famousness of you. You, yes, 20, you can afford the ticket. You, you can, can afford a twenty-four hour parking garage. I don't live near one. I keep telling you that. Walk the extra three blocks instead of going. It's not it's an 10:45, extra. It's I gotta not get an extra three blocks. It's an extra yeah. fifteen-minute walk. I, ever since you joined that garage, I've watched you slowly ruin your life. Oh my God. Let me tell you the amount of smells, and I'm not joking. The amount of smells I smelled to that corner and to the next corner. It's not a great street. And there were like 20 smells and like 15 of them were like gut wrenching. It's not a great. It's not a great street. There's a smell about. Four storefronts the down. Smell that smells like a, actually come a to, shit took a come shit. down to Joey. Don't, don't, yeah. actually, it is a great street. Come it to is Joey a great Road. street. Joey Roses, everybody. One seven four Remington Street. We're here now in the RV. Just to plug it one more time, we're open Tuesday through Sunday. JoeyRosesNYC.com. Come visit us. This was our first ever two part episode of Taste Buds. Boy, did did it get heated? As we used to say on the You Know What Dude podcast, this was a goddamn gator fight today. <laughs> All right, let's uh, before see we go, before who we go won. On the phones, you got anything? You want to plug bud uh my tour i go on my website uh daybargetsy.com i got a bunch of summer dates and then fall dates are up uh go check them out all right i you love you to not know nate one of the best comics yes. in the country come on give please go see, see nate. nate thank Absolutely. you yes. uh, all right yeah so here we go this is called the humble pie segment okay because somebody's gonna eat some all right we get a drum roll right now pimp goes to the pole we can't see the screen like usual so pimp you're gonna have to tell us Ready? all right With 16% is cake. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! <Come on. laughs> I love it. You love to see it. You love to see it. You love to see him go on a two hour self righteous diatribe and then eat his own nuts. You love it. Uh, second place with 32%. Wait, 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 wait. 16% means there's 84% left. Okay, which means that 82, that means something at 32%, the winner uh, has 50, 56%. Yeah. You can yeah. do math. No, but I just Let's yeah. slow it down even more. See, I just want to see how big the disparity is between the second and the first place. Okay, all right. So 30, 32% is cookies. Uh, come I on. mean, it feels. You let him come into knew, our house. You knew that that, that was going to happen. I didn't. You know. Did you know cake was coming in last place, you dildo? No, but I knew, but I knew ice cream was going to be cookies. Yeah. Ice cream Where, already. Where did you think you stood in it? Ice cream already beat cookies. I thought cake had a chance of taking the crown. I thought cake was going to be a, a wild horse and let me take no, over. No, ice cream. Is no, 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 that's what I'm saying. Dominated. Once, I, knew, once yeah. I saw cake was in third, I was like, okay, ice cream won. I'll be honest with you. It doesn't, it's, uh, thank you for everybody uh, for being just a normal person and a good, you know, that you understand life. And they, 
But it's like it is not a fair fight. Ice cream is doing that good. I so. gotta be honest. I can't believe ice cream wins. Ice cookies cream is are the thing. No, I don't they're understand not. How Justin, cookies cake. Ice cream cake cookie rank them. To you. To me. Yeah. Woo! Exactly. Exactly. How did cake get sixteen percent? I'm, I'm gonna go ice cream and cookies cake. Okay. I'd go I ice believe. cream cake cookies. I go cookies cake ice cream. And I'm doing cookies just because you're here. I can't believe cake <laughs> got hit that hard. I can't. Sixteen percent. That's nuts. I don't think cakes in people's lives that. You're, much. you're like Eddie Mush it's from not, Bronx Tale. You don't know how yeah. to pick a winning horse. Like <laughs> cookies, cookies and ice cream are very much in people's lives, and cakes not. Uh, it's not reached to the point where it's like just kind of like, ice oh, you want a nice is, piece of cake. You have ice cream half a year only. No, you have ice cream all the time. It's that good. I have, yeah, a, I have I a winner, dude. I go to McDonald's. Ice cream and I go to uh, get a Sonic Blast. At, uh, let's take a Blizzard. It's not as good as a Blizzard. A it's, Blizzard it's is Sonic, another though. level. But you, he just brought up McDonald's. He get, he filled your McDonald's. A potion. McFlurry. Oh, bring yeah. it up. Beautiful. He didn't bring it up. He brings up McDonald's and all 84 uh, episodes. I mean, yeah, I think we should show Fuck. McDonald's more res, uh, respect. Oh. I think you should wear a tuxedo at McDonald's and go, it's an honor you even opened the door for me. We're the most successful restaurant in history. We did McDonald's versus Wendy's. It's McDonald's not even close. Mc, I know. Oh, McDonald's. Yeah, That's why eyes. I want to this do is the what rematch we do, for you here. Open your eyes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you're the winner, so you have to say... You still love us. That's how it ends. Oh, I, I love. Still love you, baby. I still, still love you. I still love you. We, we still love, love you, you too. too. Yeah. All right. Taste buds. They come into the mic, talking about the food they hate, talking about the food they like. Two fools gonna fight, but only one food can be right. Taste buds, man. Yeah, they come into the mic. I'm talking taste buds.